My name is Will Anderson. Uh, among other jobs, I work for the DevOps Collective, which is a nonprofit organization based in the United States. Um, we're dedicated to, uh, you know, culturing or building communities and uh, engaging people and uh, educating them on DevOps. I started using PowerShell uh, about four years ago. Um, I was working at a company where I was. Uh, doing patch management with System Center Config Man, and um, I was the only one doing it <clears throat> for this company in in the country, and it was a uh, it was a nonstop job, and you know basically from Patch Tuesday to to the end of the month and even in beyond, you know it was all me deploying patches and handling you know all the reporting and all of the analysis and making sure everything went smooth. So. Uh, I started getting hip to PowerShell and um, automating all of these things that took up my daily work and actually reduced my workload significantly as a result. What don't I do? Um, so now uh, I work primarily in the in the cloud. So I'm working with uh, Azure and automating uh, the build processes for infrastructure as a service as well as software as a service, past deployments. Um, so I, I do a lot of PowerShell in that respect. Uh, I do a lot of desired state configuration for maintaining, you know, virtual machines in those instances, uh, as well as you know, educating and mentoring other people on the benefits of PowerShell and helping them to uh, become PowerShell gurus, as it were. I wouldn't say it's important to be a PowerShell expert, but what I would say is that PowerShell is. Uh, a significant enough tool. Uh, it's it's embedded in just about every Windows product, and so many third parties have have gotten keen to it and have you know built it into into their tool sets as well. VMware, Cisco, and you're seeing it on Linux and Mac now. And it's it's important to at least understand the fundamentals of PowerShell in order to be able to get your daily tasks done effectively. You know, if if you're Doing a point and click more than once, you need to know PowerShell because you know that that repetitive point and click just leads to, to mistakes, and PowerShell takes all of that you know all of those clicks out of the equation and just makes things a lot smoother. Um, yeah, I, I sat with uh, in, in Bartex uh, session on PowerShell on Linux, and I'm not a Linux guy. I've been a Windows guy for about 20 years, and uh, you know just you know, picking up and seeing how it interfaces with the operating system and realizing, you know, the, the familiarity that I have, uh, you know, with PowerShell uh, actually has a high probability of enabling me to, to better administrate Linux, which is not a system that, you know, I know natively. So, um, you know, I sat in on his, his discussion and it was is very enjoyable and, um, you know, I learned a lot from, from his example. Yeah, I, I love attending uh, ConfiU. I, I don't, you know, get many opportunities to go inter, intercontinental, and um, you know, seeing the the community on this side of the pond and interacting them with them in their their environment, it, it's a really great opportunity. And uh, meeting new faces, obviously, um, you know, my my biggest thing is yeah, I really enjoy talking to the community and getting their feedback. And you know, the going abroad gives me uh, a chance to to hear more voices than I would normally hear at other con conferences back home.